Okay, we are back for another round of Zomboid. And in this video, we're going to finally get a car fleet. Yes, we're gonna go out, go out and get some cars. We've already got the keys to the police cruiser down here, so that'll work out well. And it's still a little bit dark out, so let's, let's actually work. Uh, I wanted to, one thing, and it's in the back of my mind, and I always forget to do this. Let's check our, so there's no holes in the shorts. The leather jacket has two, military boots, none. You can't repair the, I don't think you can even repair the bulletproof vest, but that's interesting. It does have one, we do have one. So we're gonna have to see if we can find another bulletproof vest and then make this one the backup. Uh, but, the but the leather jacket we can definitely repair. So let's do that. Um, we need denim. And I don't have any denim in there. Uh, let's. This is why I wanted that zombie pile. It's kind of risky to go out there at this time, but I'm gonna be a little bit careful. Um, we do have the night vision too, so you can see pretty good. I just want to see if we we should have some. One of these guys got to have some denim. Uh, let's look through here. Baggy jeans. That's not gonna do it. Ah, speak of the. That's what we need. Okay, denim shorts. Perfect. All right. So I don't know if we need to wash those or not. Um, of course, we, we're after those denim strips. That's what we need. Okay, so we got the denim. Um, let's come in here. And now what we need is we need the needle. We need the scissors. And we need the thread. Okay, and we're encumbered, of course. Uh, so we hit the scissors here, and then we rip the clothing, and we rip the long denim shorts. And we only got, oh, we got dirty. I can clean those with water? All right, let's clean them. That really wasn't uh, what I, oh, well, we got two. Okay, so we should be able to plug both holes. Okay, that's what I was concerned about. So let's go down to the, uh, let's see here. Let's go down to the leather jacket. We hit inspect and there they are. Let's plug these guys up uh, with the denim strips. It's not perfect. It only, I, as you increase the tailoring, uh, you get a, a better patch, but it's better than nothing. Let's just say that because this is this would just be exposed completely exposed so that's better than nothing uh, and we're out of the strips okay but that's good we'll take it uh let's keep put put all our tailoring supplies back this is why i'm trying to stay organized all right so we got still got a little bit of time um maybe what we'll do you know what we got to go we got to get the gas cans i'm trying to remember what we need we need the gas cans because we got to go to the fuel station and let's see how the generator's doing. 77% fuel. So let's stop this. Let's turn it off for now. Let's take the gas can. And let's fuel up the rest of this. So we got 100%. There we go. Um, so that's good. Let's put this. Let's take the other gas can too. And since we're heading out for a while, we'll just keep the generator off. And then what we need to do is put the rest. Why am I? No, we're going out here. Yeah. And then what I need to do is put the rest of the fuel in the police cruiser. And this will be our primary car. So this is going to be the primary car. And then what we'll, we'll have is a, a backup, couple backup cars, one like a loot car. And then maybe another one uh, to bash zombies with, you know. A car we don't really care about. But these police cruisers, I generally like to keep these as my, my primary car. And keep them in good shape. So this will become our primary car. We don't have a lot of fuel. Maybe I shouldn't have put that fuel in the generator, but that's okay. We, should, we don't. It's just a short drive, so. I'm going to... Whoa, 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 whoa almost hit that almost i am the i think i've told you this guys in my other epi uh, episodes i am the worst driver ever in zombie i am so bad i'm not gonna flip the lights on though because i don't want to attract that would attract zombie i hate these 
burned out cars. They drive me crazy. In fact, when we get a car that we don't care about, we're going to push those off the side of the road. So I just don't want to be running into them all the time. Okay, so we're coming down here. Let's just be real careful because I... Oh, of course there's got to be zombies. And we're just going to get down here and then back the car up. If I can do that. Okay. We got some, we got some zombie action for sure. This is I am so bad at This is the one part of the game I am so bad at. Let's get out of here. Um, let's do this. Let's get the... I shouldn't be playing around here. This is dangerous. Um, let's get the cans in here. And I should not be screwing around here. I was worried... Oh my gosh. Here we go. Okay, it's on now. Um, what do I... Do I want to... You know what? Let's let's come down here. I wasn't expecting this many. I thought I cleared them, but you know, it's it is the zombie apocalypse after all. They do sort of just show up. Oh boy. Okay. Not what I wanted in the morning. Ooh, need a coffee. Okay. Oh, I hate when it does that. I just hate when he doesn't swing down like that. I don't know how. Okay. Oh no, 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 no. No. Okay, let's go sterilize bandage. That was not what I wanted. This is going this is going really bad. Alright, well hopefully that doesn't lead to an infection, but we'll see. I don't think so. What? 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 <laughs> Wait a minute. That was the worst swing I've ever seen. How come you. <laughs> this just drives me crazy. Okay. And we got more. All right. I think I'm just going to fight these guys regular. I'm getting tired of that. You know, I, I'm starting to wonder if it's, it's just a waste of time. I'm starting to think the fence is not the. I, I do better just fighting them. I don't know what it is with these fences, but it's like I think I just do better fighting normal. I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna just fight normal from now on. I say that, and here we go. Okay, that was just bad play right there. Okay. Glad I got the military boots on though. <laughs> this is why I hate fighting multiple zombies. I, I mean, I could use the car, but I didn't want to use that car. The reason I'm doing this is because I want to save that car. I don't want to really bash it up, but... I don't know what it is with the fences. They look easy, but they're not. I, I always screw it up. I'm thinking I might just fight him regular from now on because uh, it's just not worth it. Okay, so is that it? Uh, we do have a sterile. I don't think that hand injury is going to be too bad. Did we get a hole, though? Yes, see? We got a hole right on the leather glove. Probably saved us from getting bitten, but we're going to have to patch that. I, I don't know if you can patch. Let's see. Yes, you can. Okay, so we'll have to remember to patch that. Wow, that was that was something. Okay, way more than I wanted. I was hoping to just have a nice trip over here, and then there's a bunch of zombies. All right. Well, anyways, we get to turn on the turn this guy on, and then let's let's fuel up. <laughs> that was way more effort than it should have been. All right. So we got that. Fill. I gotta be. I gotta watch it because this generator could attract uh, zombies too. So we're going to get empty cans uh, filled up here. 
And now I'm encumbered, of course. All right, so we got one of the cans filled up. Let's fill the other one up. Perfect. Okay, and we're going to keep one of these cans next to the generator to, to just fuel up the generator. And then the other can, we will just use that to fill up cars. So, good deal. And I did fill up the cruiser, right? I'm sure I did. Perfect. All right, and we kept the cruiser. I don't. I think we checked these cars. They didn't have keys. I'm trying to remember. I don't think. I can't remember what cars were checked. Now, <laughs> uh, probably should eat here. Um, let's do that. Let's eat this. I don't want to bring a, a big horde of zombies right now back to the to the station. Okay. So this just became our primary car. We're just going to park him right out in front here. That's good. Uh, perfect. Did I turn him off? No. That would have been uh, not a disaster, but it just would have been a waste of time. All right. So let's take the... I'm going to take the one gas can and keep this this so we'll keep one of these gas cans i'd like to find a few more gas cans for sure but uh we'll keep one of the gas cans here at all times for the generator and that should keep the generator fueled for quite a while and i think the generator is the generator off or did we yeah we got it off for now we don't need it on right now um going to actually try to conserve the 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 gas, believe it or not. There's a lot in the fuel pumps, but it's not unlimited. So it's best to keep that off when you're not around. All right, so we've got, let's, let's, uh, let's get reorganized here. So we're gonna go up to the military base, try to find another car. What I wanna do is keep the crowbar. There we go, get that out. And hopefully uh, we don't run into a ton of zombies, but you know, that didn't go so well with the, uh, and we gotta keep an eye on this wound too. Um, I just thought about that. Let's, let's make sure we've got a dirty bandage. A sterilized bandage should last a while, so I do not want to get that infected though, but it doesn't look like a major wound, so let's just, I don't think we got infected there, but I do have to remember to you know what? I was just thinking of something. So we're coming here. We got to bring the cars through here. And that's... I don't know if I can fit them through there. Let's get rid of these guys up here. Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure I'm going to fight with those fences anymore. I'm just not sure. Let's see if there's anything here. Can't really use a credit card in the zombie apocalypse. It'd be nice. Um, so what I'm thinking here is I don't I don't think I can fit the car through here. I just thought I'm glad I thought of this. So we let's get rid of some of these. I think we can destroy these. I've never actually I don't know if I've destroyed these things before, but it looks like we can. Um, let's just get rid of a few of these, and then we can just come through here. We should be able to make it through here. I don't know if we need to get rid of all of them, but I think we at least need to get rid of... Well, we definitely want to get rid of a couple of these guys. Yeah, I just want this lane open. So we can, we can actually keep this one... those sandbags there, but I want to get rid of this one. Now, you know what's going to happen. I can already predict what I'm going to I'm going to hit these. <laughs> and you know what? I'm being lazy and I'm going to hit these. So, you know what? We're going to come down and just get rid of this cuz this is this I'll hit this. I'll be driving and I know I'll hit it. So, I might as well just get rid of this one. These I probably won't hit, but okay, there we go. And this is why I'm always looking for the sledgehammer. This thing is a beast, by the way. It's a total, look at that. It's still, the condition is still good. I mean, it, it lasts a long time. Okay, um, as long as you don't use it for fighting, which I'm not. All right, so let's, 
be cautious here. I say that and I'm sitting here running. Okay. Um, oh, we got a whoa, bunch of them. Wow, what is going on there? Okay, that's not good. There was a ton of them in that corner, just like parked out there. Uh, what? Let's see. I don't really want a van. Um, let's check this car out here. I better look around too, and it's getting foggy, of course. Locked. Move on. I don't want to start. I could bash that, but I don't want to start a car alarm. So, well, this isn't a good sign. Two, both the cars are locked. Okay, not a good sign. Uh, let's check this one out. Okay, well, at least we're, let's unlock the trunk. Uh, let's check the. This is where you always check. Ah, yes, 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 yes. We got the key. Okay, awesome. So let's jump out and put our fuel in. Awesome. So this will become our designated secondary car. Um, we're going to use it for looting. It looks like it has quite a bit of space. So it'll be our loot and we'll use it to run over zombies when we have to. So this will be our like our secondary car. But I am so glad because I don't have hot wiring right now. I need to get that ability and that's something we need to work on. But in the meantime, actually, there's quite a bit of fuel in there. But we're going to go fill it up anyways. Um, I am so glad that I got rid of those. This fog just is horrible. Now I'm glad. I, I, there is no way I would have been able to get that car through there. Yeah, I'm glad I thought of that because there is absolutely no way I would have got through there. This is... These are actually really good cars. I like these station wagons because they have a lot of space and they can take a lot of damage. I've noticed in the past, they, these things can take a ton of damage. So they're good cars to sort of, uh, I, I, I like this as a secondary car. It's almost like it could be your primary car, but um, I just like the police cruisers having that as my, my primary car. Okay, so let's get this guy. If you guys know, if you've watched my other episodes, you guys know I am the worst driver. I would not pass the driving test in the zombie apocalypse, but the good thing is we don't have to pass the test. Okay. So let's... This is always... This is really dangerous because we're... I can't even see what's coming at me. Not only are we vulnerable here, <laughs> we've got fog. I mean, it's like the worst time possible. Fortunately, the car was like almost half full, so... Didn't really have to spend a lot of time filling this guy up. Let's get the empty can. And things are going really good. Things are going really good. Let's actually put... You know what we can do? For now, we can just use this to store our empty cans. I need to be really careful here. Um, and we got some duct tape and a tire. That's always good. Okay. Definitely need spare tires, too. Okay. Uh, especially if we go, like, on a long road trip. Though this island, I don't anticipate doing long road trips. But still, it's not a bad idea to have a couple. All right. So we've got our backup car that we can use to run over zombies now. Uh, we can do a ton of damage to this. And if you guys have watched my other episodes, you know what I like to do. Um, I like to bash up a car as much as possible, and then that becomes the car I like to train on for uh, to, in to improve the uh, mechanics. So this is a good secondary vehicle. So we've got uh, a mini fleet going. Um, I think that's good. We probably we'll definitely need more cars, but I think that is a great start. Um, we are in really good shape. I'm in really good shape now. I'm feeling much better. I, I, 
certainly didn't. We better check the wound. I'm not happy I got injured, but I don't think that that's going to be a huge issue. We'll have to repair these gloves, of course. Oh, you know what? Let's do this. I do want to wash myself because of that wound. Let's. It's raining out, so let's utilize the... We definitely should wash all the clothing, too, because we that, that helps prevent an infection. So let's just get everything washed up. Good deal. Okay, so that's, that's good. Um, and I think we're in really good shape here. Okay, so uh, that'll do it. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video.